Hi, I'm Joel Bolton and I'm the guy who came up with this crazy idea to launch a nationwide children's online instrumental music competition. And just for a little bit of extra fun, I decided to run the entire thing myself. So it's been a bit of a wild ride, um, but and I've had a, a lot of sleepless nights. Well, not so much sleepless, but very late nights. And um, But to compensate for that, it has been wonderful to see all these lovely videos coming in. And I have to say that in every video, um, there is so much charm and so much musicality and so much potential. So even though, of course, we couldn't put everyone into the semi-final and in some ways that would have been a lovely thing to do. But um, although we couldn't do that, I can I assure um, all of you out there that you all have immense potential uh, to do well and um, I would certainly encourage you to, to keep practicing and um, keep loving music because it's a, it's a lifelong gift really, something you can enjoy for the rest of your life and um, and share with others as well, which is always a, is a lovely thing to do. So um, some reasons behind the competition. Um, I guess it's a little bit normal, uh, sorry, it's a little bit different to the normal kind of competition, which are often pretty stressful. And, uh, you know, sadly, there's a lot of people uh, who, are, you know, suffer from stage fright. For every one child who loves getting out there and would perform night and day and uh, it gets a real thrill out, of, thrill out of it, there are plenty of children, hundreds of children, who find the whole idea very daunting and for that reason stay away from it. So I really wanted to give um, these kids and, and the other kids as well, of course, um, the opportunity to um, to perform in the comfort of their own environment you know whether this is you know in the lounge at home or in a hall that they're familiar with or, or in their teachers um, studio um, I wanted to give them the opportunity to comfort to um, perform um, in the most natural and relaxed way that um, was possible and um, I think I've seen that in, in a lot of the videos that have come through um, people looking very comfortable and um, I think as a consequence playing in a way that perhaps they wouldn't play on stage. Um, so that is definitely one of the main reasons to... Um, oh, one thing that occurs to me by the way is that um, as, as teachers, I've, I've been a teacher for about 30 years and um, you know and there'll be a lot of teachers watching this as well I'm sure and I'm, I know probably one of the most common things a teacher ever hears is I played this a lot better at home. Well kids, um, now's your chance to prove that in this competition. Um, what else did I want to say? Yeah, um, probably the main reason for, um, for starting this whole competition is that I really want to inspire other children to learn an instrument. I don't know what the statistics are these days, but I'm fairly confident that a lot less children are learning instruments than they used to. The world's full of distractions. And um, perhaps the idea of sitting down and practicing most days is, is um, not something a lot of children really want to do. But um, so much joy comes from making music and getting better and and um, it's good for children on so many levels and uh, I want as many kids as possible to benefit from learning an instrument. So I'm hoping that this competition uh, will inspire a whole bunch of kids to start learning an instrument and, uh, and look, the thing is, it's not just the children, you know, have made it this far into the semi-finals and, and, and on to the finals. But in every single video, um, there, are, there are performances that, that will inspire others. If you're just a beginner who plays the, you know, very simple little tune, 
there'll be somebody in your class who'll say, hmm, um, I could do that too, maybe. Um, and perhaps when they see someone who's very competent, it may seem too daunting. So at whatever level you're at, um, you have the ability to inspire. And um, I think that's a, a very powerful um, skill, apart from your musical skills, that you, that you have to, to give to others. So um, that's all I want to say. Sorry, it's a bit of a ramble, um, but um, I'm good at that. Most music teachers are good at talking. Um, so um, I appreciate you listening, and we will now get on with the show. Bye. <clears throat>